For some illnesses or injuries, you may need an imaging test to help your doctor make a diagnosis, treat, or monitor your condition. The one most of us are familiar with is x-ray imaging. X-rays provide us with a picture of the structures inside the body, especially the bones. Besides showing broken bones, x-ray images can help diagnose arthritis, osteoporosis, digestive issues, breast cancer, or infections. You've probably also heard of CT and MRI scans. A CT scan uses a series of x-rays to create cross-sections of the bones, blood vessels, and soft tissues inside our bodies. The patient is positioned on a table that slides into a scanner. The whole process takes about 10 to 15 minutes and the resulting images can be used to diagnose broken bones and other injuries, tumors, and cardiovascular diseases. They may also be used to guide biopsies. MRI uses magnetic properties and energy pulses to produce incredibly detailed images of the entire body. MRI is non-invasive and requires no radiation. Washington Regional houses two state-of-the-art wide-bore MRI scanners to maximize patient comfort during the examination, complete with music and LED lighting. Thanks to our newest technologies, patients with joint replacements and electronic devices such as pacemakers can now be safely scanned by one of our nationally licensed MRI technologists. MRI can help diagnose neurological conditions such as stroke, aneurysms, multiple sclerosis, and spinal cord issues as well as soft tissue injuries of the joints. For both a CT and MRI, you might be given a special contrast dye before your scan to highlight the area of your body being examined. If you need contrast, it will be administered through an IV and you may be given a special solution to drink. Ultrasound is also part of the imaging department. If you've had a baby, you likely had an ultrasound during your pregnancy. Ultrasound creates images using sound waves. The technologist applies gel to the area to be scanned, then moves a probe over your skin. Your doctor may order an ultrasound to look for gallbladder disease, reproductive issues, check for blood flow issues, or to monitor pregnancy. Nuclear medicine imaging utilizes small amounts of radioactive material and a special camera to capture pictures of the inside of your body. This type of imaging is typically used to diagnose cancer, endocrine disorders, gastrointestinal issues, heart disease, and neurological disorders. Lastly, interventional radiology, or IR, uses real-time video x-ray called fluoroscopy to guide minimally invasive treatment procedures. Examples of IR procedures include placing stents or gastrostomy tubes, biopsies, and catheter or port insertions for patients undergoing chemotherapy or hemodialysis. All these imaging specialties provide important information to your care team to help determine and carry out the best treatment plan for you.